Orangutans are docile and can be found in the rainforests of Malaysia and Indonesia. They're actually classed as apes and not monkeys and spend much of their time in trees. They're naturally quite shy and solitary, but are very intelligent and their diet is mainly fruit with some vegetation and the occasional insect thrown in. They have 94% of our genes, so it can be of no surprise that the name orangutan means forest person in Malay. They've been known to live over 30 years, whether in the wild or in captivity, but very sadly are on the critical list for being an endangered species. This is mainly due to their habitat being drastically reduced by deforestation for palm oil and also by poaching for the illegal pet trade and bushmeat. However, there are several charities that are dedicated to the conservation, welfare and survival of the orangutan. We pray their numbers will drastically increase soon, as we've seen with other species recently. Palm oil, which comes from the oil from the fruit of palm trees, is big business. Indonesia and Malaysia contribute 85% of global supply, which goes into ice cream, pizza, chocolate, toiletries, cosmetics, animal food, and many of our tin and packaged foods. It's a very versatile oil, which makes it so popular, but it comes at a great price to the rainforests and the wildlife. Of course, this is not the main priority for many of these global companies and child labour and exploitation are used in an effort to boost profits. However, it's not all bad news as palm oil can be farmed sustainably. Companies need to promise not to clear primary forest, to be transparent, to treat workers fairly and to make safe zones for wildlife to thrive. In this way, they can use a stamp on their products, saying that they use sustainable palm oil, as stated by the RSPO, the Round Table on Sustainable Palm Oil. However, strict checks must be put in place to ensure that companies are heeding to these rules, with eye-wateringly large fines in place if they're not. There are many alternative oils that can be used, but even more land would be needed to produce the same amounts that are made from palm oil. I'm not a scientist or inventor, so I don't have a viable solution, but I'm sure that someone out there does, and soon we'll hear some great news. Global manufacturers need to make it clear when they use sustainable palm oil. It would make a difference to consumers, it would make a difference to Mother Nature, and it would make a difference to the orangutan.